Okay, let's make a start. It's IELTS speaking part one. I'm going to ask you a number of different questions and you have to answer. Are you ready? Yes, I Is do. your heartbeat normal? No, sir. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now, I play. Yes. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> yes. Your heartbeat is fast? Yes. Okay, don't worry. It happens. Yeah, it's normal. Yeah. I'll ask you some difficult questions, so you'll be fine. Yeah. Anyways, do you make plans every day? Yes, I do. Plans. Mike, please. Yes, I do plan because I am the person who likes to do works with plannings. So to answer your question, yes, I do planning. Okay, I do planning before anything and all that. Are you good at managing your time? I oftenly good. Uh, oftenly is wrong. Fastly and oftenly, these two words don't okay. exist in English. I so often, I often. I often uh, good at managing my time. I'm often good at managing my time. time. But if something came in urgency, it's difficult to and it also makes me sad. Okay, so to answer your question, so answer your I question, am good at time management, but sometimes some it becomes difficult yes, for me. Yes. Conclusion is very important. Okay, sir. Uh, what is the latest plan you have made? The latest plan, I have made a trip to northern areas with my friends. Uh, we enjoyed a lot there because it was according to my plan. So, uh, the last uh, time I made it was... Okay, what is the hardest part of making a plan? Uh, the hardest, uh, the difficult task of making plan is uh, to do actual work for which I have planned. If something goes beyond the expectations or are not according to my plan, uh, it's not uh, uh, feel good. Okay, this is good. Just you need more confidence and control your heart. Have so you given your heart to anyone yet? No, sir. It's no, right here. It's right here. So yes, please sir. control it now. Inshallah. Yeah, otherwise you say, Mera dil tera. <laughs> yeah? Uh, I've got a friend actually his name is Yasin when he got engaged yes, he started sir. listening to songs Tere naam humne kiya hai jeevan up for five years he was engaged and he <laughs> listened to the song Tere naam humne kiya hai and all that and then he got married and right now after five years of marriage you know what does he listen to yes what lai vi na gai tere bhai vi na gai so yeah, these changes actually come ahead it's not him another friend yes, his yes. name is also Yasin Hafiz <laughs> not him <laughs> okay, so anyways, that's fine. Okay, okay yeah, so just okay. relax and control yourself. This is good. We give you more pressure than you going to get in actual exam. Yes, please. Yes, sir. What is your favorite festival and why? Uh, my favorite festival is Eid because I belongs to Muslim I community. I belong to because I belong to Muslim community, and uh, Muslim celebrate Eid celebrations twice in a year. Uh, first time Eid al-Fitr after the Ramzan and okay. second time Eid al-Fitr So to answer your question, Hajj. my most favorite festival is Eids. That's good. Okay. Now, let's go on. Uh, how do people celebrate this festival? Now, don't go into the detail. Just in four or five sentences. How do people celebrate this festival? People have to do a lot of things to celebrate their festivals. Like to celebrate. To celebrate their festivals, like they have to wear the new clothes, clothes, and clothes, and also shoes, and sometimes they decorate their homes and uh, also distribute the sweets among the friends. Yeah, so this is what people usually do to celebrate this festival. Okay. See, brief answer, right. and at the end there must be conclusion. Don't okay. leave it open. Right. Let's go on. What is the most popular festival in your country? The most pop uh, Pakistan is a diverse country. All the communities and cultures are in Pakistan, like Muslims, Christians, Hindu. But to answer your questions, uh, I think the Eid festival is most common because the Muslim uh, is our majority. Muslim community is in majority, majority, majority in so that Pakistan. Is why. That's All why. All right. This is good. One last question. Uh, do you celebrate these festivals? Yes, I celebrate uh, all these festivals, including the uh, Christmas also because I have also many friends who are uh, uh, who are the Christians. A Christian. Who are the Christian? Christian yeah. Who are the Christian? And some of my friends belongs to belong to belong to. Sorry, some of them belong to a Hindu community. They celebrate uh, Diwali. Okay. And I also celebrate. I also celebrate with them. All right, this is very good. This thing shows you are like uh, all normal. If it is UKVI, these type of answers are really accepted there. Well, uh, never okay, answer sir. that shows you are fundamentalist. Okay, especially in UKVI, never give any answer that shows you are a fundamentalist or in the future you might turn into a fundamental person and all that okay just give normal answers because in UKVI they check each and everything even if you touch your nose they say okay he touched his nose 
all right so because of the surveillance cameras and each and everything so never take politics and religion in your answers in IELTS speaking this is my advice politics and religion right just answer normally it's okay fine okay. thank you thanks a lot thank